But why did they film Lord of the Rings in New Zealand? Because it's the most beautiful country on earth. Because they could save more money on makeup by hiring locals to play the <laughs> <laughs> That actually is a good one. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Keen is another one of my favorite words. Anyone who knows me really well knows that I say this word a lot. Keen means if I was really into a girl and I was talking to my mates, I would say, I'm really keen for that girl. <laughs> Yeah, that's perfect. Okay, ready? Great. Got it? Yep. What are you guys doing? What are you doing, Kemi? Can you just not do that? Please. Like, oh, seriously. What's the difference between yoga? Australia. What? Yogurt has culture. <laughs> no, that's fair though. <laughs> really fair. That's so fair. You guys need to get that whole part. And I do a kissy face. It's a kissy face. What? Is that too tight? Yes, you're strangling me. Good. You to stop talking. No, but you're done with that, you move on to the cream. And once you're done with the cream, you put in some water. <laughs> Have you seen the compilation of that girl? Hey, she here I am. What's her name, eh? Hey. What do we got? You're just gonna have to feel this one. Give it a little smoosh. Okay. If you want. Yep. Up a bit higher, higher, higher. <laughs> what is this? See, but if it's you... It's like a frame? Yeah. A picture frame? Yeah. <laughs> Good job, Carl. I just licked your face. Oh, Wouldn't be the first time, my friend. Carl Sprouse's camera. Anyhow, I'm just having the time of my freaking life. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, and it's just sick, you know, when, when you know, one of your best mates is you're going camping on the 4th of July and he's on his phone the whole time. Like, I love that. You know what I mean? I love that. It's the whole point of what I was saying. Was he was injured every single time. Yeah. Hey, KJ Charles. Don't interrupt me! Every time you see that. Go. Ew. <laughs> 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 you look so it went on my nose. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. How do you do that? 
2.32. That's disgusting. That's horrifying. <laughs> KJ, look what KJ. KJ, look what this look what she made for me. And not you. So many Aussies wear thongs. Because shoelaces are too hard for them. <laughs> <laughs> That's rude. Yeah, That's kind of rude. rude. I haven't introduced myself so I'm Ray. Hi Ray. <laughs> Please meet you. Ooh, boys. <laughs> this is a message for Casey Cott, who once sat on a pot and thought to himself, wow, I'm really hot. Until David walked down the street and said, no, you're not. <laughs> David's right. Uh, can you quick line up? Yes. Uh, bring, uh, Can't help it, I'm just... 17. 17. We're in high school, I swear. Yes, please. Sleeping. Shut up, dude. Sleeping. I'm trying to sleep. Why couldn't you get any sleep last night? Cause sleeping. <laughs> you fuck off. Hey guys, guys, don't you think it smells like up dog in here? What's up dog? Not much dog, what are you up to? <laughs> Hesitation, my friends, is the next topic that we are talking about today. When it comes to protecting your loved ones, you never, ever hesitate. Listen, no, the legality of the situation was that, you know, Jughead is primarily a human species at heart, but in the manufactured hesitational way, there is some kind of blockage of the system of the pipe. Which brings me to my next point, that every uh, cinematic circumference that comes under the transparent viewership of every single primal uh, counterpart means that we can't break forth. So in conclusion to my narrative of the counterparts of every single mechanical cinematic viewership of every punctuation mark is that there is no ending. There is no start. There is only being. So, again, I will say, although we are alive, we are no longer part of the mammoth population.
A real work of art. Wow. Oh, shit. Feel more on the tracks. Feel more. And Jax. And. hindsight um i'm pretty devastated of the uh outcome uh you know most of the boys are pretty uh freaking devastated but um uh, pretty i'm pretty sure he was trying to say something pretty significant to me but i was kind of like just distracted by uh most of the other people. exactly what i would was saying to him, but he was trying to give me like a different um, answer. So I was like, you know, give me something more competitive, you know, because there's more people out there who are trying to be like, at the end of the day, it's more of a uh, um, uh, kind of struggle to be actually being there for the children, mostly because it's more the, um, the other people that are trying to be, uh, you know, I'm trying to tell them. I'm trying to tell the the people that that there's more actual uh, circumstance between each scene. There's you know character work to to do with with that. Anyway, guys, that's uh, that's me for the night. So you know, if you think you can challenge me on that performance, then uh, you can call me on eight one eight two seven five one eight three. Absolutely not going to give you my number on this. So <laughs> funny when I see people walking around on the street, you know trying to do what I do, it's, uh, it's just kind of, you know, gnarly. You know, it's a mathematical equation that I still can't find the answer to.